morning, everyone. I decided I wanted to vlog today for fun, so here we are. It is Friday. I feel like I don't look well, and it's probably because my sleep lately has been not good. I'm gonna check my sleep score right now. <laughs> I've been like consistently going to bed at 3 a.m. And it's not even for nefarious reasons. I just can't stop reading. It's like, oh my god, I don't even realize it's that late and I will look at my phone I'm like, oh my god. I gotta get it together, but I, I can't. Like, I just have to keep reading. I have an aura ring, so it checks my sleep. My sleep score yesterday was 45, maybe, I think. So let's see what it is. Oh, are you kidding? So my sleep score last night was 63. This is fair. My sleep score the night before was 46. <laughs> um... How? I'm gonna put a screenshot of what I'm seeing on here so y'all can see too. I have literally never had the restfulness metric be anything but in the red. Ever. It says restfulness tracks your wake of successive movement, getting up from bed during your sleep. I always get up. I always have to pee, like avoid spicy meals close to bedtime. Like I'm not doing that. I wanna see my readiness score. I don't actually want to because I'm afraid. Okay. Today my readiness score is 68. I guess on that note, we can get started with the day. I just wanted to do a classic day in my life today. I've got work to do and also plans later. So I thought that it will be fun to do a little day where I'm actually leaving the house and having social plans, but also being productive. We've got a good balance today. So I thought this would be a good day to vlog. I also feel like I haven't just like vlogged a day in a while. I've done like a couple days or you know, bits and pieces of stuff, but I feel like I haven't just done like a full day in my life in a while. So here we are. It is so sunny outside, which is amazing. Um, we have a flood watch for tomorrow, so that's interesting. Hate that, won't be leaving the house tomorrow. Okay, we need to do my opening shift in my apartment. I need to, bro, please. I need to do my opening shift. I love calling it that. It just makes it more fun. In my apartment, making my bed, setting up my coffee machine. I'm gonna make some warm lemon water. I've been doing that the last couple of days and I actually really like it. In an attempt for the first thing that goes into my body for the day to not be caffeine. That's what I'm trying to do here. She sees a bird, there's a bird outside. There it is. Look up on that geo. <laughs> Predator in the wild, locking eyes with a prey. Pounce at any minute. The unsuspecting target, oblivious to the predator's eyes watching them. Oh, good job, Charlie. You scared him off. Go, girl.
Okay, checking in. I imported my footage for two different vlogs that I'm working on right now. And then I just always start editing while the footage is being imported and then I lose track of time. I lose all sense of self. I forget to drink my coffee. I forget to pee. I forget that I need to eat. And so now here we are. I've been sitting and rough cutting. Now I'm hungry. I just remember that I had a coffee here. So I chugged like half of it in the last five minutes. I'm gonna need it because I just got a text that, did I mention that I'm going to? Yeah, I think I did. They're going to my friend's birthday party tonight. I just got a text that the party starts at 10 at this bar, but she's having a pregame at eight at her apartment and I was invited, everyone was invited. So I wanna go to that because if I don't start the night earlier, I won't make it. Like I can't start the night at 10, I just can't do that. Where was I going with this information? I don't know why I told you that, but I mean, oh, that's why I needed the coffee. Okay, right, right. I'm gonna need energy to keep me going. But yeah, that's what's going on later. I still have to obviously figure out what I'm gonna wear, which is a whole other conversation that I am never prepared for. And every single time it comes to this, especially with going out at nighttime for some reason, I rarely go out. And when I do, I have this issue every single time. Like, what do I wear? So that's gonna be a conversation for later that we're gonna have to figure out together. I also want to shower before and wash my hair because it's been some time. I have it in a bun right now so that you can't tell that it's quite gross. So I wanna shower, wash my hair, and then blow dry my hair after that. So that's gonna take some time too. I'm like just trying to figure out when I need to start getting ready. The mental gymnastics of trying to figure out when to start getting ready so that everything's done in time and also so I don't rush and make it not fun for myself. I go through this every single time I go anywhere. I need to make food though, so I think I'm gonna go do that because I can't focus ever if I'm hungry. <laughs> but it's literally the middle of the day and I kind of feel like I should just take a shower now so that I don't have to do it later and I can sit is this like stupid no I feel like it'll pick me up I always have a midday slump so I feel like I could use a little pick me up feeling refreshed also then I won't have to do this later so I can edit later I'm gonna try to make it not take me forever like I'm hoping 30 minutes max for this entire process of my shower washing my hair and blowing out my hair but I feel like it'll make me feel better, hopefully. And I can just really lock in for a few more hours of editing. Charlie! Hi! Where's she going? She loves to lay in the sun. You love laying in the sun. She just makes every day so much brighter. Oh, I hear you. Here the fuck we go. My hair is dry. Oh, oh my god. I can't even like that was so insane. You know a hair washing day just hits different sometimes and today was one of those times. So happy I did that now and <laughs> not later. I'm now gonna sit and edit for the foreseeable future until I need to get ready. I may have made a colossal mistake by sitting on my bed to do this, but my butt was starting to hurt on my desk chair because it's actually quite uncomfortable. I've had it for a while. It's just is so like flat at this point that I really want to get a new one. I'll get around to it. I should probably do that at some point because I sit there for a lot of hours. Harley, isn't this just the bee's knees? I'm drinking the other half of a poppy that I opened last night and then didn't finish. I decided against making another coffee. So I'm gonna take this. This is 
a productivity shot from Magic Mind. I've done it once before and I feel like I felt good. So I'm gonna do it again so I can get into my editing groove. There's matcha in this. So my ear also randomly hurts, which is great. Cheers. Oh, the turmeric I'm tasting. All right, let's get to it. like this water over there as we know by now also for her I got an Italian sub. They call it a hero here. I didn't know that the first time. So I ordered it on the wrong bread. But we have rallied. Oh, I love an Italian sub more than I love so many other things in life. And of course, every time I get a sandwich, I have to get chips. So I got some sun chips. I haven't had them in a hot minute. I am so hungry. This is my dinner. Holy fuck. Get out of here. Get out of here. Bye. I cannot even explain to you bitches in words how good that was. That is by far the thickest Italian sub I've ever had. And it was fantastic. Oh my God. Oh my God. I feel renewed. <laughs> I feel revitalized. Glad that I got that when I did. Now I can let that settle a bit before I start getting ready and all that. I think I want to wear this, but like this is extremely risky just because it's cropped and I, you know, my body confidence hasn't really been the best. This is my issue with going out clothes. Everyone's just wearing the smallest, tightest, cutest little thing. And I'm like, I can't wear that. I will not feel comfortable or confident if I wear that. But it's like, if I don't, what else am I supposed to wear? All my other things are like not going out vibes, but I guess anything can be the vibe if you make it the vibe, but it's also just like, bro. I feel like it's a lose-lose. I feel like this is low-key half the reason why I never go out because I don't want to have to deal with this. I actually have no idea what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna let that settle for a sec. Thought and also my sub and then we'll, we'll regroup. Hopefully we don't have a breakdown about this because I usually do. As expected, I did have a slight meltdown. <laughs> Picking an outfit. The one that I was gonna wear originally did not look good, so. I did land on something though, so that's good. Three games from eight to 10. I'm gonna get there at about nine, which I feel like is all right. Here's my outfit. This top is from Abercrombie. These jeans are also from Abercrombie. Blazer is from Princess Polly. And then I've got on my trusty Sam Edelman Winnie boots. Finished up my makeup. I actually really like how it turned out. I did my makeup while making a rant video about body image that I don't know if we'll ever see the light of day on the internet. Here we are, I'm ready to go. I will see you so soon. I love you. I'm getting an Uber. I would literally just subway, but at this point I'm just over it. I don't really, I just wanna get there. Let's go out in New York City on a Friday night.
this wine and liquor store. I hope it's still open. Why does it look closed? Oh no, it's open. Secured. out this late. Charlie's like, and where the f were you? Where have you been? I really want to talk about really, really, really bad. <laughs> this is like huge, huge news for me. Okay, so I really, really, really want the Doritos Locos Taco. Doritos Cheesy Gordita Crunch is so fire. Now where's the f***ing sauce? I like need them to give me hella sauces. I've been thinking about this for so many hours. I need this in a way that is concerning to feminism. I need to take off my makeup in a way that is concerning to feminism. Hi, Char. Talk about confirm my order. <laughs> yeah. You guys are never gonna believe this. Talk about that I ordered. Shut up. I need to change. Hold on. Ignore the utter catastrophe that my apartment is in at the moment. I'm redecorating. I've been saying that for like a week, but it is true. There's just kind of stuff everywhere, but all right. So allegedly I ordered 12 sauces. Oh my God, I think they actually gave me 12. Okay, this is definitely the Doritos, Locos, whatever the f This is the beefy <laughs> layer burrito. out. Stop. I'm so excited. Okay, no, I fully got 12 sauces. That's wild. I literally don't know what this is called, but it's f***ing fantastic. My favorite thing from Taco Bell. It's the Doritos Locos taco, but then like wrapped in. You guys know what the f***. Like, am I? Hello? Why am I explaining to you Taco Bell like you guys don't f***ing know? Oh my God. Happy f***ing Friday. Hell yeah. Going with the fire sauce. Oh my god! Come on now. <laughs> this is genuinely so good. No. <laughs> Sorry. I've been talking about Taco Bell for all night. Literally all night. I don't really care if there's battery acid in this. I'm gonna fucking devour it. This is the burrito I got. I think I'm doing a mukbang. That was like mostly tortilla. It's three in the morning. Perfect. I still have to wash my face, take my medicine. Literally everything's a mess. Everything in my entire apartment is a mess. I'm exhausted. I need to take my makeup off, wash my face, give Charlie her treat, clean her litter box. Bro, I understand how people go to sleep with their makeup on. I personally could never do that. I won't be relaxed. I'm not relaxed until I take my makeup off. My point is I'm seeing how <laughs> people could do such a thing because it's tempting. I won't lie. Oh, I need to make a liquid IV. This is the liquid IV tangerine one with the immune support added in. I took these almost every day in Thailand, actually. I think they taste good too. Like, am I crazy for that? You know what? I had fun though. I made some new friends. It's all about putting yourself out there and just putting yourself in social situations. I don't know. I'm proud of myself. I had a really good time. Three tequila shots, one cup butter. 
Why the hell did I say water? I don't say that. I say water. That was crazy. One cut water keel soda with lime juice, which is my go-to, by the way. These were all spaced out over a period of several hours. <laughs> also, like this was not like a bus club mother club situation. I'm gonna go ahead and take off my makeup and it's gonna be the most amazing feeling in the entire world. I'm gonna drink my liquid IV, wash my face, brush my teeth, and get cozy. The thing about me is no matter what happens like no matter how late i'm out no matter what i drink or how i'm feeling i will do my skincare routine i will at least the very very least take my makeup off wash my face put on some moisturizer and i feel so much better every single time i don't actually know a time that i've gone to bed in my makeup oh my god i forgot i washed my hair today Jeez, what a day it has been <laughs> oil is on. Hyaluronic acid is on. Oh my god. Hello. Okay. I'm so exhausted. It's ridiculous. 3.42. 3.42 in the morning. Goodbye. Okay, perfect. I just need to like move all this stuff that I threw around earlier. Trying to figure out an outfit. Just my whole apartment needs to be cleaned so thoroughly. I don't even know. I don't even have the words for it. Oh, there's just stuff everywhere. It's insane. Like this whole pile of shoes that I tried on. I don't have the time. I don't, I can't be ours to deal with it right now. It's almost four in the freaking morning. I have not stayed up till four in the morning. I don't think in the last six years. I'm going to bed. Good night.